Hello, everyone. My name is Julia Andreevska, and we are here today for the Industry Agnostic Unicorn Battle, where the best local startups will pitch to our great audience worldwide. Our startups are industry agnostic, and we are live and broadcasting all over the world now. So please share the links with your community so everyone can see that you are online. Please welcome the next startup from the North Carolina, uh, Magic, the winner of Unicorn Pitches. Mm -hmm. Good. All right, let's go. Hello, everybody. In today's society, we cannot imagine our lives without consumer electronics. And I'll tell you how Magic is standing at the forefront of consumer electronics revolution to become organic. And what we're not thinking about commonly is the fact that or get, uh, LEDs of today are in fact harmful for our eyes as well as the environment, even though we use them daily. Currently, the display industry began to shift to organic lighting main diodes or OLEDs for short. In fact, most of you have an OLED cell phone today, and they're safer for humans and the environment. But OLEDs cannot become mainstream due to complex manufacturing. They're made like layered cake, one layer at a time, making manufacturing way too complex and costly. 90% of companies we talked to indicated that they use scarce elements, which will run out by year 2040, and OLEDs are simply missing out on $1 trillion worth of revenue that currently LED market is holding. And the, to enable 90% faster manufacturing that our customers want in order to move from 20 layer design to a three layer cake without using the flavor, it requires them to look for new suppliers and new material solutions to make this possible. Our solution is to enable three layer design through our novel proprietary multifunctional materials platform. We'd we'll be selling our materials in the form of powders as shown down on the left and directly sell them to the manufacturers to plug and play. Our materials use all organic and earth abundant materials. They're simple to plug and play with current manufacturing equipment, and they enable power and consumption and greenhouse emissions reduction on a global scale. Display market is conservative, so we had to adapt our go-to-market strategy to first serve the needs of luxury items and specialty displays, then expanding into lighting and window technologies market, which would establish a track record to enter our ultimate consumer electronics market, allowing us to reach $1 billion worth of revenue by year 2030. Historically, all, uh, as OLED devices came to market, new materials focused spin offs would appear to address newly occurring needs. Margic has emerged to address the needs of new eye safe, environmentally friendly displays. We have a growing ambitious team. I'm Margaret, founder and CEO. I have PhD in nanoscale science with experience in core technology of the company and background in materials engineering and production. Rusty brings commercial and global supply chain experience in, in the display industry, and we bring maturity to our company through mentors and institutional partners. We're growing through international mentoring programs and accelerators. We have raised $1 million in non-dilutive funding since November of 2019, and we currently have four research scale pilots and six letters of intent from potential customers. We are getting our product directly to customers' hands, and recently we have received feedback that it's not only simple plug and play, but it also outperforms currently used solutions. Our next milestones is to pro uh, production of uh, pilot scale to do risk our launch on the market. And with that, I would like to thank you for your attention and please feel free to reach out to us. Sure, thank you so much. And q and is open. Please, Kelly, your question. Uh, hi, Margaret. Great presentation. So my question is, on average, how long is your sales cycle and what are your go-to-market strategies? Yes. So in order for us to reach a global scale, like I told you, for the $1 billion, it will take us until year 2030. But we're planning to enter the market in, next year on a small scale entry, which would enable us to uh, think about the fact that uh, we can scale up rapidly from there on. So our niche markets would be luxury um, items such as smartwatches, special marketing, lighting materials and so forth. So we're planning to enter next year. Thank you. So uh, you will hear the music. That means that the votes are being closed. And at the end of music means the end of voting. Here we go.
Okay, so right now <coughs> we are ready to see how did gets voted. Can you please show it to us? <clears throat> you can go to the event page. Everything is official. Everything is happening online. Sorry about that. Okay. And do I need to reload the page? Will we see the votes? One, two, three. Okay. IT tells me I need to reload the page. Startups, startups. Aha, uh -huh. here are our startups. Okay, so uh, Sonopathy was the selection of the guests. Okay, very good. Let's go to the business angels. Congratulations to Sonopathy, to A. Orion, to Pure Fresh Wine. That was one, two, three. Okay, little bridge, different, you see? Business angels voted a little bit differently. That's getting interesting. Okay, let's not stop and see how did our expert board, our judges, had put who is their favorite. Aha. Uh -huh. Guys, do you see what I see? Okay, you can start calculating but while I, I will be talking to our official judges. Aldo, you are first on my screen. Let's talk to you. Who is your favorite today? Show it. Da 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 da. And official judges have as their winner. Aha, uh -huh. Sohopathy. That is interesting. Okay, are you ready to see the ultimate winner, the startup who will present the the its industry at the uh, Unicorn Cup Finals in just two weeks? It is. It is. Margie, congratulations. It's your turn to say a couple words. You did really great. Too bad my camera wasn't on. I just jumped up as I saw <laughs> that. That would have been really funny. <laughs> uh, but yeah, thank you so much for everybody's attention, feedback, some awesome questions. I felt like a shotgun fire trying to respond to everybody. Um, I really appreciate the fire drill of questions. It means a lot. That means this is a really important issue to not just me, but everybody out there. And uh, we're uh, geared up to resolve our new generation of electronic devices to make them safe, that it's not going to be piling up. Uh, I'm sure all of you have at least five old cell phones in your drawers, <laughs> so we want to get rid of all of that eventually. And yes, I appreciate everybody's support. I'm very excited for what's to come. Congratulations, get ready, two weeks, and it will be World Finals. Wish you all, all the luck. And now it's networking session, open mic. Uh, who wants to say a couple words, you're welcome.